Guy Gaming, or Vapson, excuse me, and welcome back to another episode of GTA 5. And um, today we're going to be playing with Trevor. And yeah, um, I'm actually using the controller today because um, I tried to look up this mission. I knew what the next mission's name was. Like for PC, like everybody said they had to use a controller for this mission. So that's what, I'm, that's what I went ahead and done. That's what I went ahead and done. And, uh, so, yeah, um, I thought I kind of messed up my, uh, Username and in um, intro just there a while, while ago. Say, so how do you run with the controller? Nope. Apparently, that okay. Because I haven't used controller in like probably a year, year and a half. Because I've been playing on PC all this time. Trevor is a, the Trevor, Trevor is a. Trevor is a what? Trevor is a good guy. He cried family and got kid and he's funny. That, 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 that's it, right, yes, Trevor. <laughs> but, but, but the thing is, um, I ain't been with that many women. I don't find it easy. And, um, and Deborah, I mean, we're, we're getting married, so. Oh, that's beautiful. But I'm scared that she's gonna leave me. I mean, this is her place, and the fornicating? There's Mr. Raspberry Jam. Whoa, whoa! Now, Mr. Raspberry Jam, he died a noble death, bringing great joy to a lonely man. I ain't got a very big penis. Some girls laugh when they, when they look at it. Oh, show me. Oh, show me! Oh, I, 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 I don't want to. Oh. Mine ain't nothing special, but this boy gets the job done, all right? Now, Wade here says that you work at the docks. Uh, yes. Look at me! Can you just put your Johnson away, sir? Oh, Jesus. Yes, I work at the docks. And? Anything uh, interesting there for a man like me? Well, I mean, I, I, I don't rightly, rightly know. What kind of person are you? Well, I'm that kind of person, Floyd. I am that kind of person. Now, let's get you, Wade, and that little tormentor down there to put these on. We are going for a ride. Gentlemen, the gateway to America awaits. Run. We got an inside man at the port of LS. I'm going to send you some information. I need you on point to help plan things. I got it. I might have to censor that part out, but I don't think I've seen anything, so... I think you two be okay with that. I don't think I, don't think I gotta censor anything out. Looks like we're going to the docks today. You know where the port is? Come on then, Floyd. What you got for me? Like I said, I don't rightly know what we got. You're going to have to be more exact in your questioning, sir. Ah... Uh. We're looking for something to steal. Yes, sir. I stole a pencil in elementary school, and I've been regretting it ever since. Boy, golly, quite a kicking a mug. Uh, look. Hey, now. Sir, please, just tell me what you want, and I'll do my utmost to assist you in finding it. Here's the problem. I don't know what I want. It's a bit, well, like pornography or a perfect turd. I can't quite describe it. I'll know it when I see it. You ain't aiding my comprehension. Are you looking? All right. Well, how's this? Two hundred and thirty-six billion dollars worth of cargo came through the port of Los Santos last year. He's real good with numbers. I don't want to hijack a truck full of pineapples, Floyd. You need to give us the inside track on what's coming through. Well, we don't know what's in the containers. They certainly don't put price tags on them. Oh, have you noticed anything? 
anything different? Anything that might indicate something? Well, there's been all these uh, Merriweather folks hanging around. Merriweather Security Consultant. Merriweather Security Consultant. Private army to the New World Order? My butt's gone The now. boss waging outsourced shadow wars in 20 countries around the globe and recently cleared to operate on U.S. soil? That, um, sounds like them. So there's a private militia in the port. What are they guarding? This one freighter? I guess... I guess now that you mention it, it ain't quite right. A freighter. Can I get on board? No, no. Uh, they won't let you anywhere near it. They're kind of assholes about it, actually. The, the other day, my colleague, Ralph... I don't give a shit about Ralph. We gotta take a look. Is there anything else? There's another bunch of Merryweather guys out by the Navy warehouse. They got boats coming in and out. I heard they was testing something. Go park and get the dispatch. Uh, yep, yeah, well do. Go park and get the dispatch! Alright, looks like we're here at the mission, so... Here comes the suit. I gotta check in. Remember, Floyd, this can go yeah, real that was a pretty long, long dialogue. Real quick. It don't matter what went in his mouth, it matters what came out. We got a waste spillage and I got a slot on the cleanup crew. There is nothing that Wade here ain't gonna do for a warm meal. Hope you got a strong stomach, son. <laughs> Get in there. You gonna take me to see this freighter? <sighs> yeah, it's over here. You ever got helicopters coming in and out of here? And all those big sky crane things that can pick up a whole container? Now, this is restricted airspace. Now, they won't get anything out of here without clearance. They shoot it down if they have to. So how's a man in a hurry supposed to get in and out of this place? Well, we got a port that stretched to 50 feet. Now, what's the Coast Guard response like? Well, they got cutters, 45-foot response vessels, air support. You're not gonna move much faster than them, especially if you're carrying something. Maybe I'll have to saddle you up and ride you across the Miriam Turner overpass. I also hate this controller vibration. Like, this is driving me crazy because, but like I said, I haven't played with the controller. I'm like. In like, you know, a year, year and a half. I just said they had the water surface real covered. Okay. That is the freighter I told you about. What do you think they got on it? We just stickered her. We ain't meant to know what's in the containers. But? But these are marked military. Government. Anything weird about that? The government stuff is hot freight. Pulls up, goes right through. This stuff's just been sitting here. You are beginning to arouse my curiosity. Merriweather guys at two o'clock. They're giving Forrest a hard time, all right. You, you, we need two guys on the handler. A couple of containers and baby got to be brought up to F. That ain't a question. Get on it now. Okay, get on the thing, Trevor. Get up. We gotta do this. I guess I gotta pretend I'm a dock worker if I wanna stay. How about I run that prick over in this thing? I thought you wanted to scope the place. We don't get the containers. They're gonna check your card. Oh, I'm getting nervous. You're always nervous. Relax. Not always, sir. Just around you. And it's just Cousin Wade's on his own. He better hold it together. Stick to the story. He'll be fine. Boys on a waste clearance crew. It's those containers. Baby. Clap it on now. Okay, we got it. Let's take her down to Bay F. I know why they call them handlers. Because they handle like a dream. This ain't a toy, sir. It's heavy machinery. Thank fuck I'm high as a kite. You should not be operating this vehicle while under the influence. I'll operate you under the influence if you're not careful. Uh-oh.
Let's try that again. Run that prick over in this thing. I thought you wanted to scout the place. We don't get the containers. They're gonna check your car. I guess I, I, guess I couldn't fit for that, but you're always nervous. I don't see how that Not made us fail the mission, sir. but just around you. And it's just a cousin Wade's on his own. He better hold it together. Stick to the story. You'll be fine. Boy's on a waste clearance crew. He's never happened when he's neck deep in shit. Those are the containers in Bay B. That's it. Now we gotta bring it over to Bay F. I know why they call them handlers. Because they handle like a dream. This ain't a toy, sir. It's heavy machinery. Thank fuck I'm high as a kite. You should not be operating this vehicle while under the influence. I'll operate you under the influence. Life lesson from Wayne. There it is. Now I guess we gotta get the other one. I'm gonna need a better view of that freighter. I'm sorry, but this is as close as you going to get. Nah, nah, nah. I need to take some pictures. Okay. Send them so. to my guy, Ron. I'll need a proper view. There's the cranes. One but more crate to go. Perfect! Oh, shoot! Alright, looks like this part of the mission is fairly easy so far. I'm gonna lose my job! Hook it up! Hey, whose dick you have to suck to get this job? Being a stevedore used to be back-breaking work. Now you're paid brain surgeon bucks to push an oversized shopping cart. Now, I did not felatiate no one to get this job. Was oh, well, I was not paying attention. Lamar, you distracted us, Lamar. What does it say? Third time's a charm. How about I run that prick over in this? Thing? Oh, I can do that all I over again. You wanted to scout the place. We don't get the containers. They're gonna check your card. Oh, I'm getting nervous. You're always nervous. Relax. Not always, sir. Just around you. And it's just a cousin Wade's on his own. He better hold it together. Stick to the story. He'll be fine. Boy's on a waste clearance crew. He's never happened when he's neck deep in shit. It's those containers. Baby. Okay, apparently we didn't grab that. And attach it. Okay, we got it. Let's take her down to Bay Air. I know why they call them handlers. Because they handle like a dream. This ain't a toy, sir. It's heavy machinery. Thank fuck I'm high as a kite. You should not be operating this vehicle while under the influence. I'll operate you under the influence if you're not careful. You happy? Now I'll get the other one for you. Me, anyway. I'm gonna need a better view of that freighter. I'm sorry, but this is as close as you going to get. Nah, nah, nah. I need to take some pictures. Send them to my guy, Ron. I'll need a proper view. There's the cranes, but... Cranes! Perfect! Oh, shoot! Yeah, should have told him that, Floyd. Shouldn't have told him that at all. Oh, this would probably be the next heist. Because they're going after, like, a big old, apparently... 200 something million dollars. I think it's probably the next time. Being a stevedore used to be back breaking work. Now you're paid brain surgeon bucks to push an oversized shopping cart. I did not felatiate no one to get this job. There was old friends with the. Well, with the. With the. With the say no more. You didn't felate no one, but darling Debbie probably did. She probably enjoyed it. If my work here is done, I'm going up the gantry. So I guess we just park it anywhere. Now we're going to the crane.
Hopefully this will be the last part of the mission. It's probably been what twenty minutes already, I'm guessing. Because I don't have a I don't I don't time these. So who knows how long I've been recording. Is this even the right crane? I hope it is. Well, we're about to find out. If it's not, we'll just climb back down. Hey, very time to admire the view. I've been waiting on a crane driver nearly an hour. I'm not permitted to drive cranes, buddy. Hey, you need me to get your union rep up here right now? Sooner you get in the cab, sooner we can get out Oh, thank here. God. This is on you. All right, I'm here. What do I do? First up, position the cabin over a container. There's some lights on the spreader that should help with alignment. Looks like you're in line. That's lined up. Move the spreader down so we can grab the container. He said it was lined up too. It looks like I'm barely missing it. So how do we get the lights to come up? Is this not the one to grab, or what are you? Oh, okay. Okay, I see the light now. But we're not lined up with it quite yet. We're still not lined up with it. Looks good to me. Grab onto it. It's hooked up, so lift it high enough to clear that container stack and move it to the other end. We need to go to the other end. Bay 5. I don't see what the purpose of the scene is, yes, but... That's the truck. Ease her onto it. Bring the container down over the truck's frame. Oh, I think I, know, I, think I broke the truck. Truck is clear to go. Signalman and crane driver working together. Now let's do the same thing again. Get back down to the other end. Line up the second red container at the end. That's what I'm about to do, guy. You just give me time. It's a fairly easy mission so far, but Alright, you're yep. done. Break time. I have to not realize that he's not. This is some view, ain't it? I have to not realize he's not a uh, dock worker. I'm pretty sure they see people every day. I guess it's GTA, so I guess logic doesn't matter. Camera phone. Front of the ship. So I'm gonna take a photo. A button. The board. Is that the board of the ship? The back of the ship. Is that good? Yep. Send photos or on. Photo sent, and looks like we're good. Oh, that control vibration. 
This is why I don't use controllers because I'm pretty sure there's a way to turn off the vibration. But still, you know. So we gotta go down. Trevor, go go down, Tre Trevor. Okay. Trevor, come on. I can take you over to the warehouse. We can use the big rig. It's on the other side of Port City. So they've been guarding one of them dry docks. We can take a look at it, but no one's allowed around there. Normal rules don't apply to us, Floyd. We're going in. I don't know. The rules applied to me my whole life. I like rules. And look at you. You're a failure. You're in a loveless relationship. What do you mean? Loveless? I love Deborah. If she loved you, She'd be here, wouldn't she? But she's not. Uh, you know I'm insecure. You've got a dead-end job. What? Dead-end? No. Floyd, it's dead-end. Being a unionized longshoreman. A unionized longshoreman's one of the best-paying jobs in the country. You tell people around La Puerta that's what you do, they love to rob you. They're so jealous. No one's jealous of you, Floyd. They pity you. You're abused by that woman. You're abused by these slave drivers. I've mean, never worked so hard in my life. Oh, warehouse. So bad. I've been doing this every day for ten years. Only usually with less of the criminality. You're wasting your life, Floyd. It's lucky we turned up when you did. Restricted access. No enciendo. No understand you. Huh? Manifesto. Manifesto say deliver here. Mm. Hey, stop. The rules got confused. The guy don't speak English. Must have read the manifesto. He said. He said. And they don't get in the Okay gentlemen, have a good time. I got what I wanted. Go to Floyd's apartment. What can we call a cab? Alright, so it looks like this mission is pretty much over with, so all we're gonna do is look for the taxi. Go to Floyd's apartment, part of it should be done, but um in this episode we didn't really do much. I expected I expected it to be more action, but I guess the episodes will build up to the action, which is So how do you enter a taxi without stealing it? Like that? Okay. Trevor, these photos, you've really stumbled onto something. The ship Merryweather? Yeah, I know. Tell me about the ship. If we put a man with a gun on the bridge next to it and get a guy on board, I think we got a good chance of taking over. Way well, it looks to me, there's a container below deck. They're guarding it for the government, keeping it off the books. Serious military technology, most like. Yeah, of course. I just found a manifest. They're testing something out at sea. It's gotta be that. Now, get back to work. The TPI conglomerate ain't thriving. There's only one man responsible. Of course, yeah. But I'll start pulling all the intel I can get on Merriweather at the same time. I got a file here somewhere. So where do you want to go? Like and the taxi one? driver just heard everything. He don't think anything weird about that. So. Okay, buddy. There you go. Alright, so... 
go to Floyd's apartment. If you can run, Trevor, that'd be pretty nice. If you could run, please. I guess we gotta walk. to plan this now. Right, this will do. That woman ain't even fine. Ain't no one understands why Floyd lets her use him so. That's a we use her. Raid. We gotta build him back up. Now. Yeah, he, oh yeah, that's gonna be a heist. So, all right. So, based on my observations, I'd say these Merryweather security cocksnots are sitting on something real valuable. I think they got two of these things, but we only need one. First one is on that freighter in a container below deck. They got guards all over that ship, so it's likely they're keeping it on ice. The air, land, and sea routes into the port will be locked down as soon as we make a noise at these X's here. Which means we have to blow up the ship and grab the thing underwater. Need a guy to plant the bombs, a guy to look out for with a rifle, and a guy to grab the thing, whatever it is, underwater. That means you're stealing a submarine, of course, but you can find us one of them, can't you? Huh? Now, the other one is off the coast being tested. They're running the operation from the dock where I last saw your cousin. We'll need a submarine for that too, and probably a chopper, a big one. We go out there, look around underwater, locate it, bring it back here, and find out what it is. Here? To the Congo? Aye, so, what do you think? Container ship or whatever's offshore? Hmm. Whatever is offshore would require helicopters, boat, and whatever is on shore. Hmm. Well, just for the fun of it, I think we'll go for offshore. Just for the fun of it. Offshore. Deep sea adventure, gotta be. You and Floyd can help, and we'll bring along Michael and his unpaid intern. Unpaid intern. Okay, all right. What is that smell? Oh, we are going straight to the local union rep. Wade here was injured in the performance of his duties. Human waste has seeped into his very pores, and I am sorry to say this, but I don't think he's ever going to smell normal. <laughs> you can't go to the union. You are union, all right? And you vouched for us, all right? You look at him, man. Smell him. Smell him. Oh, Trevor, Trevor, uh, you're, you're planning a robbery on my place of work. You violated Mr. Raspberry Jam, and God alone knows what else. You damaged Debra. Look, my lady and my union, that's all I got. So why don't we just, uh, why don't we just let this all slide? Huh? If you're comfortable... So when you lose a lady, you got you know, the union. When you lose a union, you got nothing. I would give so him good luck, buddy. To you. Him off. No! No bad! I was like, looks like we did that mission, so... Or not. Yes, let's say that. So how we do on that mission? I mean, you did use a taxi, but you know, eighty-eight percent complete.
Uh, call him Michael and Franklin. Then we'll probably end the video. Better. Hey, Mikey, hey, listen. Loving it here in LS. Really settling in. Getting my first enema tomorrow. <laughs> anyway, I heard about some action. Yeah, huh? Yeah, okay. Oh, you bet it's okay. <laughs> listen, I gotta do a little prep work, but so far it's looking pretty tasty. I'll need you to bring along that kid you've been hanging with, Franklin. Oh, yeah. Oh, and how's your flying? You might need to take a few classes at flight school. Why would I need to do that? Trust me, you'll regret it if you don't. Gonna be just like old times, pal. Oh, we gotta fly. We'll have the controller for that, so it won't be too bad with the controller. But anyways, guys, um... It really bums me out that I gotta use the controller again. Oh, well, well. Anyways guys, um, hope you enjoyed this episode, um, so, uh, the next episode looks like we'll prepare for the heist, then I guess we'll eventually get to the heist, and, um, yeah guys, um, so, um, guess I'll see you guys later, and, um, yeah, okay, alright guys, see you on the next episode.